right before I had, had this bad knee infection, I'd had an abscess tooth. And I had no health care or anything like that. And anyway, the abscess, I, I, I stuck a needle up in it to uh, pop the capsule. I know, man, whew. it was a very hard thing to do, but I did it because the pain was too much. And that did a certain kind of relief. And, and then I didn't think about anything again because I'm a tough guy, a big tough guy. As we were going, getting on the plane, the day we were going on the plane to Spain, to San Sebastian, I felt my teeth on this side hurting. And I thought, oh, my God, if this abscess comes back, you know, I'm going to be over there. And then, of course, I knew that they had some kind of health care over there, which I, at one time I got, it's like strep throat in Italy, and they just gave me the pills, and they said, go away, and everything's fine. You know, what? Great. We played a, a, a festival the night that we got there in, in uh, San Sebastian, and then we were... We had like two days off, and, and then we were driving down to play in Valencia. And on the second day, I remember telling Johnny Bass, yeah, I didn't remember this until after all this stuff happened, that I, I'm feeling kind of sick, you know, and that uh, I'm going to go back to the hotel and, and lay down for the rest of the day. And, uh, and I did, and I felt better, but again, I'm, you know, I'm an idiot, a tough guy idiot, you know. So the, the next day, we drove five hours or six hours to Valencia, and we played a set. And on the last song, as I was singing One Bad Stud, the right side of my throat, I mean, instantaneously, it just went bloop, blew up like a balloon. And I'd never had anything like that happen to me. And, and I, but it, the song is kind of high, especially at the end, and it made it easier to sing the song so as we got in the van to drive back to the hotel, I told John Baz, I said, hey, I think I'm going to maybe have to go to the hospital, but I'll go sit down in the uh, hotel room and try to get straight. Well, I went into the hotel. As soon as I walked in, my left side of my throat blew up, and I was sucking air down my throat, and I can do it, and I could have done it until they got me to the hospital. I went to the, I knocked on Johnny's door, said, I've got a good guy I call ambulance. He called an ambulance. The police came. The police thought that the ambulance was taking too long and took me to a clinic that was near La Fay Hospital, even though there's a lot of time to get from the... And I remember walking into the clinic door, and the guys at the clinic thought that the best thing that they should do was knock me out and shove the pipe down my throat to respirate me. Mm -hmm. They knocked me out. They couldn't shove a pipe down my throat, at which point I went on 17% ox oxygen for like 15 minutes while they took me to Lafay Hospital. As I got to Lafay Hospital, I flatlined. 